Hi there. In this video, you'll find a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to manage your attended robots in modern folders. In a common attended setup, you would need the robots on your machines connected to Orchestrator, using a machine template key, and some user entities, to whom we give access, to Orchestrator resources. We start from the assumption that you already connected the robots to Orchestrator. To this end, you should have a template already defined on your tenant. Next, we need to define the user entities. The first thing you need to do, is navigate to the users page, in the management menu, and click add. The choice is yours. You can either create a local user, or add a directory group or user, from the active directory. For the purpose of this video, we'll add a directory user to Orchestrator. In the user details section, select the active directory domain the user belongs to, and then look for the corresponding username. Grant the user, the enable running automations role, at the tenant level. This gives the user, permissions to run automations. If there are no other changes you want to make for the user details, jump right into the attended robot section. Enable the robot creation toggle, and select the license type, of the robot to be created. For the purpose of this video, we'll go with an attended license. The domain and username, are automatically filled in, according to the settings made, on the user details section. You can stop right here with the configuration, and click add, to have the robot created. However, if you also want to customize the robot settings, simply navigate to the corresponding section, and make the desired changes. Remember to enable the toggle for each field, in order to make it editable. When you're done, click add. A modern robot with your settings, is created. You can always see it on the robots page, in the monitoring menu. The next step is to give the user access to the processes in a folder. In order to do that, navigate to the folders page, and add the user associated to the folder, which contains the processes. In this example, we want the robot to be able to execute processes, from the finance folder, so we grant the user automation user permissions, on that folder. A robot can access and execute processes from multiple folders, just as long as the corresponding user is added to each folder. When the connection between the robot and orchestrator is established, the processes in the finance folder are available, and ready to be executed, from the assistant. And that's how easy it is to manage attended robots in modern folders. Thanks for watching.